Hi everybody, how's everybody doing today? I have a really quick video. I have um, Creative Birdie Mail, but I have a huge feeling that this is supposed to be Valenpoodle Mail from, yeah it is, this one is. This one is from Miss Connie Monroe. It is a happy Valenpoodle, and if you don't know what a Valenpoodle is, it's from Stacy Evans Pink Poodle Crafts, my girlfriend. Um, best friend. Uh, it's from her group on Facebook, and she was she is doing the uh, friendship Valentine. So this one here is gorgeous. It's so pretty. It has a lot of texture and very very colorful. Look at this little corner here. I love it. And that is from Miss Connie Monroe. Love that. So pretty. Oh, and there's hearts in there. Oh, I like that. Very pretty. I love this corner here. Very pretty. Thank you, Miss Connie. And then this one here is from Charlie and, and Laura. From... I think it's from Missouri. I'm going to open it off camera because the address is there. I haven't seen it yet. I'm going to do it sideways so you don't see the address. Let's put that way over there. So I don't have permission to show anybody's address other than mine. Oh, I'm wondering if I can read this. Oh my. Do you guys see this? Oh my goodness, it's a little ballerina. Oh, let me get closer. Can I get closer? Oh, so pretty. Some handmade beads. Oh, I love handmade things. Oh my gosh. That is a treasure. Look at the little ballerina. Oh, this is a treasure. Oh, so pretty. Oh, look at this bead right here. Oh, it's so pretty. Do you guys see that? Double-sided, so when it, when I tur put it on my window and it turns itself, if the wind is blowing, it's going to be double-sided. And if I wanted to, I could probably put a picture in the middle. Oh, but I love the way it looks already. And it looks like cardboard. And, and napkins. Very pretty. Thank you. Thank you. But I want to read this and I want to look in here. Which one do I do? Hmm. Oh, it is a Velen Poodle. I'm reading this. Oh, yes. So she, she, I don't know if it's this part or this part. I, I think, personally, that they're done. But she thinks that it needs a little more. I wouldn't know which one needs. Okay, this one here. Okay, it's a flower. I see. But it's pretty as is. You did such a good job on this. Oh, so pretty. So this is going to be a journal um, charm to hang from the end of the journal. You can hang both of these actually together. From, oh, I can hang this heart. I can move this bead over to the side. Add another bead and put this in the middle. And it can hang like that. That's gorgeous. I love it. Or have them both separate. 
or make a chain and hang it from the chain and leave everything as is, which I think I would do because I love just the fact that you put all this together yourself. I think it's perfect. I don't think it needs anything. I think this is perfect, this is perfect, and your note is perfect. Okay, guys, that's all from all I have for you today. I do have a project down underneath. Um, what am I saying? I lost my train of thought. Let me put this aside. Oh, okay, I have a project underneath here. It's a t-shirt that has stains. It belongs to my husband. But I have an idea. So I'm going to... I'm going to record while I'm trying to do it because I have a thought in my head of what to do. And so I'm going to proceed to trying it out to see if I can get it to be what I want it to be. Basically, I love wearing my husband's t-shirts, especially after he's worn them and they've gotten all soft and they smell like him. And I like to wear them to sleep. But in my mind, I kind of want to do tie-dye, but I don't want to do your average tie-dye. I want to try to make um, blossoming tie-dye flowers. Is that a possibility? I don't know. I've never tie-dyed before. I just don't don't really watch tie-dyes um, DIYs, but I have seen tie-dye shirts. Everybody's seen them in the stores. Um, farmers markets and all of that good stuff. But have I ever attempted tie-dye on t-shirts? No, I haven't. But I have a thought of how to accomplish a flower with rubber bands. So that's what I'm going to do in the next video. I'll see you guys later. Bye and thanks for hanging out.